And time now for our Wendy's post-game recap. Welcome back to Bailey Brayton Field in Pullman, Washington. The Cougars with a 4-2 victory over the USC Trojans to even this series at one win apiece. Game three, the rubber match, will be played tomorrow in Pullman. But let's jump to the third inning. Washington State with a 2-1 lead when DeAndre Smith tied this game for the Trojans. A deep shot to left field. His sixth home run of the year, a solo shot, and we were tied at two. And it went to the fifth inning, and it was Justin Vanderbreak who broke through for Washington State. This drives the eventual game-winning run in. You see Jack Smith cross the plate there. That made it 3-2. They added another run later on, and Washington State had built a 4-2 lead. And then it was just in the hands of Grant Taylor. What an outing for him. It was Cole McMillan who pitched well for Washington State in game one, but he did not get the victory. Not the case tonight for Grant Taylor. He threw 114 pitches over seven innings, a career high eight strikeouts, and he really slowed down USC and led the Washington State Cougars to the victory. Cam Liss came on in relief. So did Caden Calber. Calber got out of some tough situations for Washington State, and it earns the victory. Tyler Stromsberg was good for USC, but he picks up the loss. 4-2 the final. Washington State bangs out 10 hits. USC 6, and they have pulled a game closer to the Cal Bears in that final run for the eighth place finish in the Pac-12 standings. A lot of baseball to go, including game three of this series. They will first pitch it at noon tomorrow, so be here on Pac-12 Washington. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Greg Heister. Good night from Bailey Brayton Field in Pullman, Washington.